go do Fresh <coughs> Art Show things now. So. <laughs> so I will take his place on that instrument, which is called the Panrus. And the next thing we're going to play is called Hugor Guru, which means landslide, except I guess it's also in the vernacular, it means helping each other. So I <laughs> don't know how those go together, but I guess it's everything happening, happening together at once.
stretch a little bit after the three pieces because we want to do the next two kind of in a row because it's supposed to be the reaching, reaching two teams. Okay. Uh, I played well, I want to play them together because, oh, okay, okay. so that people can sort of hear the contrast between the two teams. So anyway, um, we're going to let the class stretch a little bit now because it's kind of hard to sit on the floor for all that time. So um, if anybody is interested, the last couple of times we played, I told everyone what time we need and when and where and all that. But I can't do that anymore because our classes are so beautifully full that the, it's lucky for us that three people cannot be here tonight because we wouldn't have enough instruments. However, that doesn't mean you can't play. I would love to start more classes. I've got a sign-up sheet there, and if you think, oh, I don't want to join a class and learn to play, but I would like to know when there's more concerts, you can also just tick that. So please feel free. The only thing I ask is please when you write your email address, write it so that I can read it. <laughs> so I've had times when people were very excited and then I couldn't read their email address. Okay, um, back to the music. What we're going to do now is play the same piece twice. Why would we do that, you ask? And the answer is because we're going to play it in two different tunings. We're starting in the tuning called Paylog, which is what we've been doing so far on all of our pieces, and that is a seven note scale, although in whatever you play, you usually only use six of the seven notes. And it has unequal pitches, sort of like a diatonic scale, so it's, it's sometimes a little bit easier for Western ears to adjust to because it's, it's not the same as a major scale, but it bears more resemblance. And then the other, uh, tuning is called Slendro, and it's a pentatonic scale. It's a little bit like the black keys on a piano, but everything is equally distant, and it just has six notes. So we're going to play the same piece in both tunings, so listen carefully and see if you can feel just the difference in, in the mood from playing it in a different tuning.
a little on the theory that there might be some people here who weren't here when I said things before. Don't worry if you've heard it before. I'll make it quick this time. Um, this is our per first performance in our new space, which um, all of the students got together and contributed the money and all the volunteer labor to make it happen. So this is really wonderful. This used to actually be the police of Ch chief's garage back in the days when that building was the police station and courthouse. But in recent years, it had become a repository for unused sets from the community players and many roaches and rats and good things like that. So we got rid of all of them. And again, I want to thank um, people who made it possible. Certainly the group did the vast bulk of the group, the work. Uh, we also got a, a decent sized gift certificate from HPM, which allowed us to buy a lot of the things that we needed. And our landlord, Parks and Recreation, was was very understanding when we went to them and said, oh, oops, we renovated without telling you, which we never should have done, but we did, and, and they were very positive, and they said, don't do that again, but uh, they're great. If that's you know representative of our county government, we should all be very happy people. And uh, I'd also like to thank Volcano Arts Center that donated the roofing material, and last and definitely not least, the company just fire ants because we discovered to our chagrin just a few days ago that we'd been invaded by fire ants so we're sitting there trying to play going you know um, and they came and they are sponsoring us and they're giving us free treatments for all of the cultural centers so thank you very much to uh, just fire ants and if anybody needs a, a fire ant control company please call them and um, that's about all I'm going to say, except that, yes, if you're interested in this, I will be glad to have more classes. It's free. It's very easy. If you watch what most people are doing, it's, it's not that hard to get started. And I just love Gamelon so much, and I'm happy to have more students. So um, feel free to sign your name and give me your email address, and we'll talk about setting up some more classes if people want to. So OK, I'm going to shut up, and we're going to play some more. And our next piece is my Corda in Slendro Songo. And that was the concert after. Sorry. Oh, the white Okay, yeah. Um, I will. And uh, let's see, white book page four. <laughs>
instructive. If you might have noticed, we kind of trailed off there and then came back. That's because um, it, there's generally not a set way to play pieces. You, you all follow a certain set of rules, but within those rules you can do what you want and you have to be listening to the other players and we just had a little confusion. But you could see we were all listening to each other because people did kind of like, are we stopping? Oh no, we're not. Let's keep going. So they did very well. Okay, let's see. Our penultimate piece is Majumbo. Now this is the plan. Oh yeah, I don't know what it is. Yes, white book page three. Okay. <laughs>
play it. I will say there's a, a, a what looks to be a very interesting sound in light show upstairs at seven, I think. 7.30. So, you know, if you haven't had enough music for the evening, then by all means go upstairs and uh, enjoy that one too. Um, yeah, we're free. Okay. <laughs> we're free. So. Okay. Um, okay. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Who knows what page it's on? Seven. 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 Oh, you're also good. Seven, right? Three. Three.
enjoyed it and enjoy the trash art show and the light and sound show upstairs and please feel free if you're interested it's free it's fun i'm glad to do more classes so if you want to know more please sign up before you go thank you very much <laughs> Okay. Oh, okay. Hold on. Oh, okay. 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 Oh, okay.